media coverage of meaningful sovereignty efforts as a whole in Hawaii have been minimal at best, and there has always been a virtual blackout of anything that would expose the legitimate and realistic option of complete and full independence under international law. Despite this, 100 years after the overthrow, over 12,000 gathered in the streets of Honolulu to pay respect to the memory of their beloved queen and nation. We've got to talk together Rain and the windy weather Sovereignty groups rallied today to inform the public about what they refer to as a reinstated Hawaiian government. Notifying the uh, de facto government of the state of Hawaii that the lawful government is in place. It has been 107 years since this lawful government yeah, has stood up and said to everybody, listen, uh, we are the proper political authority. We don't go out and attack on a nation. We don't go the group gathered at Magic Island on Oahu and other locations across the state. Leaders of the reinstated Hawaiian government say they have revived and amended the nation of Hawaii's constitution, last revised by Pete Kalakaua in 1887. We humbly ask all of you who are listening to educate yourself about international public law and the law of nations. Public Law 103, 150 admitted that the Nakamaka Maori never relinquished their inherent right to sovereignty and control over their national land. They claim through international public law, they have the right to reinstate the Hawaiian government, which was overthrown more than 100 years ago. We are the nation of Hawaii. We do not ask for recognition. We do not beg and plead for recognition. The group opposed the Akaka bill because the members claim the nation of Hawaii is already sovereign. On that side of the fence is the United States of America and their agents, the state of Hawaii, perpetuating the lie. Now, you represent nothing but falsehood, lies, treachery, deceit. These are not words from a rebel. These are not words from a revolutionary. These are not words from Kanaka Mali, who loves his people. He loves the land. He loves their cause. everybody talking for years now talking and talking we have our own people sworn in by the United States the state of Hawaii the county our own people leading you astray over centuries. It's our birthright. And today we find ourselves outside of that house, living in a lay stand constructed by somebody else. Educate yourselves, people, for we are back. Mahalo nui. <laughs>